remarkable journey which consists of precious time and time passes us by it creates movements each and every day of our life. Fellow Toastmasters and my dear friends, journey of my life started on 20th of January 1983 when I was born in a small city called Latur in Maharashtra. I was a smart kid, but my education ruined me. Let me prove it to you. As I was progressing through my classes, my results were coming down. In fact, by the time I reached the 10th class, my father thought I'm not going to pass board exams. <laughs> results were announced. To his surprise, I passed. He was so happy that he distributed sweets to everyone in friends and family, school and colony. And my game, he never doubted me again. Later, with the help of subjects like physics and mathematics, I made it to an engineering college. Engineering, the best time in my life. It's been seven years since my graduation, but I still remember everything from those days as if those things have happened with me yesterday. That was the place where I learned how to mark proxy attendance, how to copy drawing assignments, <laughs> bunk in classes, flunk in exams, sports in days, cultural nights, and even the magic of passing the exam in one night. And that was the place where my life gifted me few of the best friends I have today. I wish those days should have never ended. But time never stops. <coughs> After engineering, I came down to Hyderabad. Attracted by a catchy line which says, Ambar Pate to America via Amir Pate. Oh. <laughs> I hope everyone knows about training institutes in Amir Pate. Anyways, I got my first job, which was quite OK, cool. I was having a nice time. But following the trend and the fashion of the industry, I used to keep my resume updated on every job portal possible. One fine day, I got a call from an organization called UBS, the Swiss bank. They were hiring for network engineers like me. I suited up. <laughs> <laughs> there was a legendary manager, Eric from America, wow. okay. and HR Vasavi, and I was sitting in that room. Discussion went quite well. After that discussion, Eric turned towards Vasavi and said, Mozam is quite good for our network operations team. Please roll out his offer and initiate his visa processing. Wait a minute, visa? Yes, my friend, visa for United States. You want to travel to America, right? Yes, <laughs> yes, I want to travel to America. There were more than 200 technocrats from IITs and NITs and foreign universities, and only few were selected to travel, and I was one among them. I was also the youngest among them. I fled to America to the land of opportunities. To me, it was an exposure to pure awesomeness. And the best part was, I had to work only for three days. And four <laughs> days were completely off. It was like my company paying me to enjoy my life out there. I explored every bride and the dark honor in the city of Chicago. Be it the place where Vivekananda gave his speech, place where Barack Obama started his campaign, streets which remain dark in the middle of the day, and streets where sun rises in the mid of the night. It was fantastic. While I was enjoying my time out there, I got a message from my home. My sister was to get married. But I was in mid of my training, which I couldn't leave. On the wedding day, she called me up. She said, I will not ask you the reason why you are not here today. But I hope that reason is worth it. I could feel the pain in her voice. At that moment, I decided I'll give best in everything I do. From that day till today, I have worked on many projects, be it the nuclear power plant in America, NASA the Space Center, Singapore Stock Exchange, thanks to Almighty and to my sister who believed in me. I did well in everything I have done so far. I was hoping I made the reason worth by working hard, by giving my best, but more than anything, it created an urge in me to come back home because accomplishments are worth only when we have our loved ones around to share the happiness. With all those moments of learning and happiness, achievement and pain, today my mind equals the same sentiments as written by Robert Frost in his poem. Woods are lovely, dark and deep. But we have promises to keep, and miles to go before I sleep, and miles to go before I sleep.
बैक्टीरियल हो सकता है